Alright, let's go. Wait, what? Will we spawn here? Okay, well, fine. Ask for help. I'm here to help. Yes, I'm right, okay. So, did all our progress we made here in the uh, town get lost? I feel like it did. Let's see. Oh, oh okay. Let's distract uh, the character, the robot again. I think I should um, bring down the audio a little bit more. There we go. Yes. Okay. So. We are going... Um, let's go back to the library. Because I assume all our progress over there is uh, gone. It's lost. last episode. Hello. Uh, can we jump down here? No? Got that. Jump! Oh fuck. God damn it. Uh oh shit. Whoa. Whoa. Parkour parkour. Legit. Okay, here's the wind. Alright, so what's in here? Hmm. Oh, so cute. Anything under the bed? I can go under the bed. Yes. Take a sheet of music, yes. notebook with a symbol on it. This one seems to belong to someone named Clementine. Everything is going according to plan. We managed to, we managed to contact the upper level before the transceiver went down. 
they are in a place called Midtown and apparently is controlled by some kind of oppressive force. I talked to Momo earlier. His eyes. I know this look. You will not come with us. I don't know what this means. It will probably be useful later. Let's go see that Momo person who Guardian told us about. Right. Let's go. What? Well, he's up there. Hmm. Now where else can we go? Is there, are there more music to be found? <laughs> all right, all right. Where else can we go? Let's see, did did uh, wasn't that robot? Oh, didn't that robot open the door? Um, oh, hello. Hey. You have a little lucky cat. Grandma made me these clothes. Pretty stylish, no? They're very fabulous. Hmm. Grandma's clothing. Can she make? Can you make me some clothes? I do love knitting. So far, I've knitted. Oh shit! Something to do. Electric table. To make you a poncho. <gasps> you inspire me, but it will not be stuff I like material around here. Oh my god, I need a poncho. Oh. Hello. Uh creepy. Hi. It's yesterday's tomorrow. Tomorrow will be yesterday's today, right? <laughs> Shoulder, all right. Hmm. Where am I? <laughs> Here he is. He opened the door for us. Now we go inside. I'm cleaning the porch of my shop again. Stop playing over my shop, you clumsy rascals. That's right. It's not my fault at all. Ooh. Scanning the area. Scanning, scanning. Is there anything here? Oops. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. I'm not finding it. Ooh, take super spear. <gasps> this is what we need. We need this for uh, the merchant, right? Ooh. That means we can get our poncho, yes! Go, let's go. Merchant, oh, where are you? Uh, oh, no, this is the wrong way. This is the wrong way. This way. Whoa! Alright. And the cable. Hello, I'm the merchant of the market. Uh, the market is, yes. I have it. Uh, here you go. Hell yeah, we got item. Electric cable. So what do we need for these ones? Ancient relic, a testament to the t the talent of our ancestors. It will cost you three energy drink cans. Can't do this. Oh. Cans. Okay. What about the sign? The marketplace. Oh. Uh, what about this? this is cheap. <laughs> a masterful piece of art of a very renowned artist. It will cost you one energy drink. Okay. And uh, all right, that's it. So we need uh, four energy caps. Right. Can I found find that in the? Uh... So I assume I have to find these and uh, take one, right? And now it's closed. Okay, so we have to find three more. Three more, all right. Um, let's go to Grandma. 
can give her the, the electric thingy. Electric cable, so we can get a poncho. Grandma, I'm back. Yes. Thank you, my dear. I'll get to work right away. Awesome. I'm getting a poncho! Can you? I can. There you go, little one. It will suit you well. How do I put it on? What else can I do? <laughs> oh. How do I. This looks really warm. Perfect for a cold robot. Yeah, but I, I wanna, I wanna wear it. Maybe I'm supposed to. Just extend it. I don't know. Uh, okay. Um. I talk to you. No. What's up here? The streets next to the street right. Uh, uh, am I supposed to give the poncho to someone who's cold? I don't know. Because what, what's the poncho made for me though? Oh, hello. How's it going? It's making war use of all that detergent. Alright. I wanna wear the poncho. Um, well. Anything going on? Can I give the sheet of music to this guy? Songs. Uh, I have a couple of sheets. Here. Mildly important information. This one was composed by a renowned algorithm. What? Oh, I should have pissed. Oh, what's this? Take saves from the password. No. Uh, show it written. Follow the. It written. follows the numbers. It looks like a binary language, a succession of zero and ones. You must be able to decipher this code in one way or another. It is probably related to the same. Follow the numbers. Is that person? Is it one of these? It has to be one of these things, right on the wall. Oh god. Uh, yeah, I'm not so sure. Uh, we will go back to that one. Remarkable companions have evolved so much. In the early days, their simple AI merely imitated human art. Now this is all their own. Humans often said that making art is important in desperate situations. These are certainly desperate times. That doesn't remember it. It's old. Recovered memory. Now, 
Let's find more of those. Um, was it we got now again? We got three cans. It was some sort of something. <laughs> Insulation, power supply. Yes, I, I know. I'm, I'm trying to kill it. Yes, it's mine now. <laughs> Alright. So, does this mean I can get inside the ventilation? Ooh. <laughs> Water! Yes. Delicious. Stay hydrated, kids. Oh, the, the box, the box fell. Now! Oh. oh, shit. Oh. Let's go! Yes. I'm the smartest cat alive. Seriously, what the fuck's the point? <laughs> I'm just... I'm back... I'm, I'm back here. Are you kidding me? Oh? Well, shit, I have to... Ugh, did my headset die? Yeah, I think it did. Oh, shit. Let's get back up here. Uh, can I open the door? Or the window? symbol on it. This one seems to belong to someone named the Bedavity Cat. All trace of organic life has disappeared except for what we call the Serps. They seem to eat almost anything that moves and breed at an incomprehensible conceivable rate. As if being locked in this city wasn't hard enough. I don't know what this means, but it will Probably be useful. We go see that normal person who Guardian told us about. Yes, we should. Alright. Let's get out of here. Hmm. But then the question is how do we get up there? Oh, this probably right here. <laughs> that was that was difficult. There you are. It's a rainbow-colored place. Mm. 
<laughs> what? <laughs> the fucking painting, dude. <laughs> Uh, is there anything in here? Ooh. I can play with ball! Yes! Okay. It's good. Why are you so sad, Mama? It's never going to work. Why did I let them go? I'm all alone now. Hey you, what do you want? I want outside. There's a picture of that child. Do you want to go there? Well, don't bother. It's a waste of time. It will bring you only loneliness and despair. My friends had this dream too, but now they're all gone and I'm all alone. I don't know where they ended up. I tried to contact them, but that fucking receiver doesn't work. My friends and I took notes of our research about the outside here. Take mine if you really want to go there. Alright. You're on your own. I'm done with the outside. Good luck. Momos is very sad. He misses his friends. Let me check the notebook he gave us. The outsiders manifesto. We must go outside at any cost. We must protect our brothers and sisters. We must stay away from Cirrus. The designed Clementines, blah blah blah, Doc and Momo. Looks like Momo's name was added later. I think we should find the other notebooks. Yeah, we have uh, two of them, so we need uh, one more, I guess. Memory. Back home too. Cow! Uh, uh, oh, back home too. I remember this video game. Oh, it's a video game. It was made just after I was created, I think. I can't remember it well. The scientists and I went, spent a lot of time playing it. It was fun. I miss it. Why can't I remember his name? More memories. Problem. <laughs> Cow. Cow. So nothing else here, huh? The radio. My radio. Oh, can I go in here? What do we got here? Is there anything here? Can't go anywhere. Well, I will see you later, Mama. Can I open the door? No. The symbol on the wall matches the one the note on the notebook. Oh yeah. I've already been in there though. We already visited this place, but we could check if there is another s other signs like that one. Yes, okay. So we have been over there. We have been in there. Uh, so there's one more place than that. I assume those two signs are the same area, right? Let's get out of here. <gasps> Vending machine.
Damn, this bloody vending machine was hidden. Though. What the fuck? How could anyone ever use this vending machine? What the fuck? to open. Can I knock? Here we go. Are they coming? Huh? <gasps> Hello. Hi. Hey. Since I can't meet you. Um, but thank you for letting me in. Ow. Oh. I still can't talk to you. Hey, uh, okay now. <laughs> You're here for Elliot? He's just over there. Oh, okay. Take oh. the music, yes! More music. Mm. Elliot! Are you here? Whoa, bro! This looks sick. Oh, look at your face. Yes, can I help you? Um, I actually don't know. Can you help me? Uh, keys? Oh, keys? What does it open? I don't know. <laughs> I show you my poncho. Oh, where did you find this? It's amazing. Let's try it on. <gasps> he is freezing. So that's why he's shaking. Yes! We did it! Oh, Thanks for the poncho. Please come see me if you ever need anything fixed. Awesome. Now he's not shaking anymore. Not sure how he can freeze if it's a robot, but... Uh, cool. Ooh, that was This tree is a scientific marvel. It's just a tree. It's remarkable that human intelligence, or whatever that word is, found a way to create plants that thrive without sunlight. Organic life requires trees to purify the city's air. Robots don't need it, but they take care of them. It's what the humans would have wanted. I don't remember the button. <laughs> Wait. What the hell? Controls. Uh, and jump, meow, light. I press 2 somehow? What? Okay. Open the blinds. Over here, the safe was. Yeah. 
I don't know. Yeah, I guess. Uh, does the light help? No. What was the uh, the hint now again? This uh, key. follows the numbers, but it looks like a binary language, a succession of ones, zeros, and ones. Follows the numbers. You must be able to decipher this code in one way or another. It is probably related to safe. Uh. Yeah, there are a bunch of just ones and zeros on the actual thing. Uh. I don't know. live in the upper flats. You won't find it in, in these towns like this. Right, so get up on the rooftop still. Bash it, Pearl. Push. That was a weak ass bounce, bro. It's. You need to inflate it. It needs more air. Does it have to? Is there anything over here by this sign? Mm. Don't think so. Ah, uh, can I check the keys again? Another the key. We have to find where it opens up. It opens now. Oh, I'm gonna machine this. Let's go. Yep, yep. Uh, let's, let's check the note again. might give us a hint. Just the. <laughs> that was just. There's a safe somewhere behind the books, right? And I, oh, here, here. Yes, there it is. We found it. 
There we go. Find his last notebook. This one seems to belong to someone named Doc. After weeks of research, I combined a spectrometer with a powerful UV lamp. With this, we should be able, we should be capable of warding off the Zerks on our way out. The initial attempt was explosive. I might have to test it on their real conditions. Oh, there's also a note in this book. It says I found the sign flaw in the transceiver, but I think I figured out how to fix it. Here's the equation. With this, we should be able to help Momo repair the transceiver. If I can communicate with the upper levels, that could be... You know, if it can communicate with the upper levels, that could be our way up. Let's show what we found. Also, we have uh, three soda cans now, so we should be able to get that one item from the merchant. Let's go get it. I wish I could just oh get down, get that. That's late. It's fabric. Ancient fabric. Three energy cans. Here you go. Oh, it's on her remembrance. This is an early model of a companion. Back then, they didn't have any personality. They were just glorified autonomous cleaners. <laughs> I think it's nice that they eventually mimicked humans. It's like they missed them. And in a way, they kind of kept them from going extinct. They're good robots. Awesome. Pizza. Alright, let's get back to Momo. Go this way. This area is so good looking. Oh, the aesthetics of this game are second to none. Seriously though, absolutely gorgeous game. I got you something, Momo. Little cat, are you still looking for those useless notebooks? Uh, actually, I found... Uh, which wait? This one. Ooh, he loves to talk. He was really a huge nerd for electronics and stuff. He was always on the verge of a great discovery. Ooh, you can't find us, but she was really brave, you know? The most fearless person I've ever met. Wait, you actually found all my friend's notebooks? Yes. Oh, what's that note? The transceiver can be repaired? This is incredible! That means we should be able to communicate outside of the slums. Clementine. Doc, I'm sorry I double I doubted our cause. I'll promise you I will find a way to reach the surface. Thank you, we might be able to find you a way up. Now let's fix this piece of junk transceiver. Hell yeah. Let's do it. Et voila! It works! Come with me! Up there, see the building high above the others? Um, no. Oh, that one? If you install the transceiver at the very top of that tower, we should be able to communicate the whole city. My friends might be out there. Let's do the other. If there is a way out, let's no they will know it. Awesome. You're the only one small and quick enough to evade the Zerks. We need you, little outsider. 
bring us to the city, to the sky. I mean. <laughs> We're already in the city, goddammit. So we need to go all the way up there. Well, fuck. Hey, we're in a new area. Awesome. Oh man, this game looks so good. What? I didn't even press 2. Damn, look at this. So it just turns on when you left click, okay? Weird. Oh, let's go. The city is full of neon. It wasn't always this way. There used to be strict energy caps. Okay, that music is weird, bro. What the hell? There used to be strict energy caps, especially in slums. The people couldn't handle the constant darkness. One day, someone lit up the rainbow lamps, neon signs all over their house. That person was taken away and never seen again. <laughs> Fuck me, bro. <laughs> the people saw food, and not long after, everyone started putting lots of lights in their homes. There was nothing the oppressors could do. <laughs> it was a way for people to see colors again, like on the outside. I think it helped. That's nice. Disgusting organic matter. What the fuck is all this shit, dude? Oh. There's the dollar sign in the monetization. Dude. Oh shit! Oh fuck! There goes one of my lives. Back door. Oh! Whoa. Oh! Thank god I hacked the door. Jesus. Um. Oh, I get it, I get it. Disgusting. Ugh, this is disgusting, man. Damn. Look at that sign, dude. 
man, look at this place. Like a giant fucking dam, bro. That's so cool. Now let's, let's turn off the light again. Corporation. That's English. What the hell? Where do I go? There we go. Ah, I push this, yes. Awesome. Oh yeah. God damn it, bro. I don't wanna be here. Oh shit. Oh fuck, they're all coming. They're all coming. Run, run, run. Aggressive. Oh. Oh. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh. Disgusting. Jump. Headset has no battery, so I, I don't hear anything right now. So I'm gonna have to end it right here, sadly, uh, abruptly. But uh, we will get back to this uh, shortly. Where well, want my headset is short, so probably tomorrow. Uh, so yeah, see ya.